YouTube, what is up? The Base Fine is coming at you again with another shoe video. Um, this video is going to allow us to go 3 for 3 with the Adidas theme as I bring you their most popular uh, silhouette, the Ultra Boost. Um, this one we're going to be looking at today comes from the gold medals pack that was um, designed for the Rio Olympics. This one is going to be the gold shoe. Uh, there's a silver and a bronze medal one as well. But I decided to go with this one instead. Um, opening up the box, we've got the tissue paper, and it just says boost everywhere. Let me go ahead and take these shoes out and set this box aside. Alright, so here's the actual shoe. Um, for those of you who are familiar with the hundreds of different Ultra Boosts that I've released, you can tell that this is basically the core two point, the core black 2.0 that was released as well. Um, the main difference coming with this heel cup that's wrapped in this metallic gold to represent the gold medal, obviously. Um, as we take a look at the shoe from the back, we can see that um, the prime knit is actually solid black at the back as we move forward. Then when we get to this area behind the cage, we can, and moving towards the heel or the toe box area we can see that the prime knit actually gets to a different tone let me show you what i'm talking about so we've got sort of three different colors in a way we've got black here a sort of bluish and grayish tint at the very top and when you move and expand the prime knit material you can sort of see the different um, weavings of the material. You can see the black, the blue, and the gray all at once um, as the shoe is expanded. Um, the cage here, along with the tongue, is this very nice soft leather. A lot of people were saying that the Adidas branding in the front here is gold, but it's not. It's really like a brownish chocolate color. Um, again, just this very nice prime knit material. Um, you're going to tell that for me pulling on it, it's a bit snug. Um, that will play a factor again in you trying to buy the shoe. Uh, what you could do or what I normally do is just go true to size and, um, just remove the insole. That allows you to keep your foot purely on the boost. And, um, to me, it's a lot more comfortable. I don't know why. Um, as opposed to wearing the insole and removing the insole is obviously going to allow your toes to f feel less suffocated or you can just go half a size up and keep the insole in um, the midsole just the normal all white boost um, the bottom we've got the ever so popular continental sole as this is a running shoe this is going to allow you to save all the wear and tear on the boost and also give you that nice traction um, and that's really about it. Um, the shoe is a pretty simple shoe, um, but the fact that it does have that gold, it may seem tacky to a bit of you, but to me, I really like it. And it's gonna be something that's gonna get a lot of wear and tear um, for me personally. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave you guys with some on feet. And uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, please hit that like button, share the video. That really, really does help a lot. And um, I'll see you guys around. Thank you.